you guys, how's it going? You are? Oh well, no, I'm still not completely better. I suppose I feel a bit better than yesterday. Thanks for asking. I can feel it in my throat a little bit and my nose is stuffy still anyway. Don't don't, don't worry about me. It, Liam's feeling a little bit better, aren't you? Yeah, so that's good news, that's the main thing. Yeah. So as you can see, kiddies are up, they're having the breakfast. So it's not looking forward to going to the opticians. She's got to go back there today. Because she's got to have her drops in. But if she'd communicated properly the other day, then she wouldn't have had to go back. There we go. Hello, Lacey. Oh, very nice. Who painted them? Mummy. Cool. Mummy. Got, she says some mummy painted the nails, she says. Oh, mummy, they're painted mine. Oh, well, I'm sure mummy will later. So, yeah, they've got cocoa pops. I'm just about to have my first cup of tea. Horrible night's sleep again last night. All the kids climbed in the bed again. Well, Liam was a bit sick last night through coughing. So he was in our bed. And then in the middle of the night, Lacey and Soph stood there looking at me. Soph said she'd had a bad uh, dream. And Lacey said she couldn't sleep. So I think poor old Rach ended up in Soph's bed. There we are. Anyways, I think today is going to be a bit of a slow one. A bit of a quiet one. Not a lot's going on. But let's get it going. Right, I'm just on the phone to my mum, but um, so it's just about to go to the optician, so we'll say goodbye and give her a kiss. Goodbye. Mm, it'll be alright, okay? Don't What's worry about it. Daddy? You still get your sticker on, yeah? Okay, then give us a kiss and I'll see you when you get back. Daddy. 46 minutes and 30 odd seconds on the phone to my mum. Um, now I think I should finally go and have a wash and brush my teeth. I'm just slobbing about today, guys. I'm in an old... Well, just a t-shirt and joggies. In fact, these are Rachel's joggies. She said to me when she got in from work, what you got my bed jammers on for? Because these are what she wears for bed sometimes. These are, you know, these are women's, not blokes. But you know me. <laughs> I don't care. I'm just going to slobbing them all day. And that's that. So, Liam's not getting dressed either today. He said, can I stay in my pyjamas? I said, of course you can, mate. And there he is in his Santa's hat watching. <laughs> Mr. Tumble! Hello, I'm Justin! <laughs> Shall we see Mr. Tumble Liam? <laughs> and Lace is playing with her babies. Daddy, it's Christmas Day. No, not yet. You wishing. You wishing, yes, girl. It is, Daddy. You're wishing, girl. You're Daddy. wishing. Okay, then it is. It's okay, it's Christmas Day. Yes, I'm listening, Lacey. It's Christmas Day. Oh. And poor little Sophie should just be about having her eye drops in. Well, she would have had them in by now, but she should be getting seen. Oh, Lacey's screaming at me. Oh, you just pretend. Oh, okay. Okay, it's pretend. Anyway, I'm going to get on, Liam. What do you say? Yeah. Not doing a lot today, though, are we? No. That's it, my mouth feels nice and fresh now. I've brushed my teeth and I smell nice. Put Rachel's perfume on. Oh, yes, because I've about run out of my aftershave. They always say, you know, why do men wear perfume when they've got their own? Other people say, you're not right in the head. But at the end of the day, if Rachel's wearing this perfume and I smell it and I go, hmm, that smells nice and it attracts me to her, then why shouldn't I wear it? Eh? If she likes it and I like it, yeah, that's the deal. I wear it. So, anyways, I'm not going to be doing too much today, guys. I'm not... Well, I keep telling you that, I think, but... I'm, we're having a massive clean, you know, on Monday, Tuesday time. Them two days, it's going to be busy. Oh, yes. Yeah, so today, it's just going to be relaxed. Isn't it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Bye. I'd forgotten about the advent, so... Day 20. Lacey, here we go. you got a lovely little heart. Let's see yours then, Liam. Day 20. I always drop Liam's. How much are we betting I'll drop Liam's? Oh, I probably will. I'm going to try not to drop yours today, Liam. I'm going to try my hardest. Aha! I've caught it. You've got a heart as well. It's same. I've got a heart in gems. Well, people, I'm in total shock. So it's back from the opticians. And um, not that it's a bad thing, but she's got to have glasses. Apparently she is long sighted in both eyes and has got to wear glasses at all times so she's chosen a pair that she's got to wear all the time including school and then she's got another pair that she's got for home. She seems quite happy about wearing them. The only thing I was concerned about was obviously this coloboma, uh, that white glare and um, yeah I was worried about that because then Rach said that she's got to go to hospital because when she had these drops in 
her left eye didn't change or anything so she's got to go to hospital basically for an eye test but Rach has asked about that coloboma if it was anything to do with that which is in the coloboma is in the right eye but the problem is in the left eye that when she's got the stuff in her eye the drops it doesn't change and uh, they have assured Rach that it's nothing to do with that glare that's fine her, her eyes are healthy in that respect it's just that she's long sighted which we're totally shocked about so it's a good job that you guys, a couple of you guys mentioned about this white glare, otherwise we wouldn't have known that she needed glasses because at home everything seems fine, um, she reads fine at home and stuff, so yeah, so it's a good job she went in the end, so thanks for that guys, but I will still worry now until she's had this hospital appointment, but there we are. The good thing is it's nothing to do with that coloboma or that white glare, so that is a relief, but... Like I said, I'll still panic and worry. Hey, you all right? Should we get your calendar open? Yeah. Five sleeps to go. Looks like she got a little drummer boy. There you go then. We're gonna have some lunch now. Crumpets for lunch and that's that. Yeah, that's all, crumpets. Okay, I still can't get over this, that little Dale's got to wear glasses. It doesn't bother me, but it's this hospital thing, but Rach keeps explaining it over and over again. So the reason she's going to hospital is because when she had the drops in in her left eye, her vision doesn't improve. I was getting it all wrapped around my, my head, I can't think straight, I'm worried. But nothing's bad, so that's good. It's just, um, yeah, that's why. But her glasses will be available by the 27th of December, so by the time she goes back to school, she'll be having glasses. Well, yeah. Well, Rach said when she first told her, she was excited. Excited about it. And she said when she first put them on, she thought Jay was stood there. <laughs> so you look more like Jasmine every day. Well, yeah. So really, guys, this shows you, doesn't it, how great YouTube is, really. You see, because if I hadn't been vlogging, people wouldn't have um, mentioned so I. We wouldn't have took her to the opticians, and we wouldn't have known. And now we feel bad. Of course we do. Rach said that she was actually sat there shaking. So, oh well, it's getting sorted now, eh? Mm. Yes. It is. Well, I've got to say, it's dragging a little bit today, guys. The time is, and do you know what? I feel so tired. I could just sleep and sleep. It's this cold that does it. So uh, we're not doing a lot. Rach's on the phone to her mom. Safe's laid on the sofa over there. There's Lacey laid on that sofa, and Liam stood over there with that Christmas hat still on. And I've got this in my head. So, neighbours just been round for a coffee, and that's about that's all that's happened, guys. Told you it was going to be a very chilled, relaxed day today. Uh, I feel like I need to get on with cleaning the house and that, but there's just no point. You want a mint? Yes, if we've got any mint, Lacey, you can have it. Yeah. Yeah, okay. Oh, forgot to mention as well, received a um, Christmas card off a good friend, John Harrison. So thanks very much for that, John. It's lovely. Hello, guys. It's uh, just coming up to four o'clock, I believe. And um, it's turned out a strange kind of day in the end. Find it out with Soph about um, having to have glasses, which, again, isn't a problem. But um, I was shocked. And I think it's sort of sunk into you now, isn't it? She says she can't see now all of a sudden. Bless her. And uh, yes, Lacey's thrown tantrum after tantrum today, so <sighs> it's just been one of them days in the end. Liam's been whiny. And now we've got to decide what we want for tea. Mm. Sausage. So it's really quiet since she's come back from the optician. Why did so Fofty have glasses? Because um, she does, mate. It's not a problem. It doesn't matter. It's just because her eyes don't work properly. You might have to have them one day. In fact, I think it's a good idea, really, if we all go and get checked. Hmm? What do you think? <laughs> We're not saying a lot to that, are we? We shouldn't do, really, because we had a Chinese last night, but um, we're actually having... Takeaway again, but not Chinese today, kebab, so 
Yeah, there we go. Never mind. I know, I know, I know. Well, none of us really enjoyed tea. I've got to say the kebab was disgusting. And then I think that's the reason why I haven't had one for a while. Because the last time I had one, we didn't enjoy it. So, anyway, it's all go again now. It's time to uh, bath the kids. It's bath night, isn't it? Mm-hmm. Bath night and um, time to hoover up and stuff. And That's about it. Not a lot's happened today, has it? Been quiet, haven't you? Mm, you can cheer up. You can't be down in the dumps like this when Santa comes, can you? So we've had safe down in the dumps, Liam whinging and Lacey throwing tantrums today, haven't we? And they've got to be good, haven't they? Who's coming soon? I don't know who's been the worst, but you should all be good, shouldn't you? Hmm? I don't know. <laughs> I love you too. The time seems to have gone slow today, but all of a sudden it's gone really quick and it's time to say goodnight to the kiddos already. Oh well, yes, they're already upstairs, so let's go and say that good night to them. Good night, little Liam. Good night. You're starting to feel a bit better now, aren't you? Good lad. Yes, and I've got to say I'm feeling a lot better. Just tired. We all need a good night's sleep. Hopefully the kids will stay in their own beds tonight. Good night, Lacey. Good night. Love you. Last but not least, little Dale. Give us a kiss. It's in the morning, sweetheart. Love you. And cheer up. Time for us to say goodbye and good night then guys. Haven't seen much of this boy today. Hello. You good, don't you? Where you been all day? You've been very quiet today, haven't you? You're a quiet boy. Hmm? Oh, still growling, I see. You naughty boy day. Oh, you so sweet. Mm. Oh, sweet. You're so beautiful. Oh, oh sweet bee boy, sweet bee boy. Well, that's the play now. Oh, it's going crackers. <laughs> no! <laughs> anyway, guys, I'm going to go. <sighs> Got a busy day tomorrow, so I, I hadn't told you, but I think I might have said it probably last week sometime that we're quite far behind with Christmas this year. <sighs> Way behind schedule. So, tomorrow we're going to fight the crowds. Oh, yes, of Lincoln. And fight the crowds, the Christmas crowds, and try and finish off the Christmas shopping. Oh yes indeed, hopefully I'll take you guys along, but I can't promise that I'll film too much, because like I said, it's going to be very, very busy, and I don't like shopping too much, and especially when it's crowded, so I'll try and vlog a bit if I can. Anyway guys, catch you tomorrow. Good night. <laughs>